what we've done in the book, The Peacemaker, is basically uh, we look at four primary principles to apply in conflict. We call them the four Gs. Glorify God, get the log out of your own eye, um, gently restore, and go and be reconciled. And so the glorify God is the most important one, is uh, when we're in conflict, usually it's all about me, what I want, what I think I deserve, how can I be vindicated? And we need to shift the focus off ourselves, get it back onto God, and just basically be saying, Lord, how can I please and honor you in this situation? How do I draw attention to the excellence of your character? How do I display the reality of the gospel in my life today? That people would look at me and go, wow, there must be a God for you to be doing what you just did, because I know that's not how you normally behave. Um, so glorifying God is the first one. Uh, getting the log out of your own eye, of course, Jesus teaching in Matthew 7, where he says you can't get the, log or the speck out of someone else's eye if you've got a log in your own. How do we take responsibility for our contribution to a conflict? Um, and then the fourth one, or third one, I should say, is gently restore. How can I go to a brother or sister who's trapped in sin, may not even see it, and, and just very gently help that person to see that something they said or did has actually offended either me or someone else. It's put tension in the relationship. And then the fourth one, the go and be reconciled, how do we actually forgive one another? How do we negotiate um, substantive issues? Um, you know, where do we send our kids to school? Do we put money into this new mission effort, whatever? Um, so how do we both resolve the personal issues, restore the relationship, and then also resolve those substantive issues that we've been looking at that caused the friction in the first place?